The biggest issue with water-based decks in Pokemon Pocket is that they revolve a lot around Misty. There's really no escaping it. You'll notice that a lot of the cards have a big energy um, restriction behind what they can do. For instance, Gyarados needs four energy just to be able to deal 100 damage and to take off a random energy. That's a lot. That's why people don't play Gyarados that much. It revolves heavily around Misty. Same can be said about Blastoise. But there is one Pokemon that you can throw into the mix that can help you kind of, you know, give energy to something else. Because some of those cards are really greedy. Well, today I'm going to be showing you guys best Blasty boy. So Blastoise is my favorite starter. Well, Squirtle is my favorite Pokemon. And down the line, obviously you get to Blastoise. It's my favorite one of the starters. Uh, it always has been. So I honestly appreciate anybody that can make this deck work if you don't have to use Misty all the time. And that's what this deck is all about. So Goldeen and Seeking is a card uh, that you only need one energy for. And I know a lot of people don't play with this card because it you might think it's kind of bad because you're only dealing 80 damage some of the time, right? Sometimes you deal nothing, sometimes you deal 80. This is actually pretty good. Um, you have 100 HP and you do have to flip a heads, but sometimes you can just win a game right off the right off the bat just by getting a heads. It's really, it's really good. Um, I don't know why more people haven't tried to play it, but Raven, um, Raven um, HS actually, he sh also streams. He actually made this deck. He said use, you know, Sea King and Blastoise. And it actually worked out fairly good. All the energy that you have after you put one bit of energy onto the Seeking or Golding goes straight over to your Squirtle or your Blastoise. So every turn, you're just putting more and more energy onto the Blastoise. Really nice. Um, and you only need five energy on this thing to really get it hitting for 160. But with three energy, you're still hitting for um, 100. And that's a lot. And now I still do have Misty in this deck because it just makes it a little bit better. Um, and also I feel like you still do need to run this in there. One day I hope that you don't feel like you have to, but if I didn't have Misty, I could still run it. The deck would just be worse. I didn't want to play with a deck that would just be um, extremely worse. I just thought that it'd be better because you'll notice a lot of these games, Misty just doesn't hit and I'm still doing okay. But versus some people who have ramp in the game, it can still be, you know, kind of, uh, kind of good. Which is nice because you know everybody has ramp in this game most archetypes do you know in some form or fashion misty's just has to be a little bit better than others for the most part but yeah we got two sabrina we have one giovanni two misty professor's research pokeballs you know the works i decided to throw in a regular blast laws as well because i was having some issues where sometimes i would i would lose my war turtle or lose my um squirtle because i don't have the 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 final line Getting that extra bump of HP can sometimes be worth it because if you're gonna lose your War Turtle, I'd rather have this Blastoise on than have nothing at all. So that's why I threw that down on there. Um, if you don't wanna do that, you can opt to just go for another Giovanni. There's nothing wrong with that or maybe a potion, whatever you like. But I really enjoyed playing with this deck. I thought it was great. I thought it was fun. I hope that more people will play with other cards other than just what's the best deck out there, right? I'm talking to you, Pikachu lovers. And, uh, and you, Starmie lovers, <laughs> and you, Mewtwo lovers, all you guys out there. No, I'm just kidding. Play whatever you want to play, but I do like to have some different options out there, right? So I hope you guys enjoy the deck, and let me know how you like it in the comments. I'll see you at the end. Peace. It's pretty good. Is Blue Sky the next Bitcoin? Blue Sky is the next social media um, that's been really popping off. We're going second. Kind of wanted to go first. Apple B B B B's. Apple Apple B's. Apple B B B B's. Apple Apple B's. Finally, somebody that's actually playing pretty fucking fast. I like that. Me let's stick doing one-handed tricks and I'ma be sipping on Dricka. No flying shit. I'ma be the flyest chick. No fly. Apples was fire when they had the uh the number one the dollar drinks. 
to my Applebee's. Oh, yeah. I never went to Applebee's except for like twice. And like not even the same one. I remember somebody said they had like found rat a rat in their soup or something. I was like, I, I can't do that no more, man. <laughs> That's the one that was back in my hometown. I was like, I ain't going there no more. Bra. If I kill him right now, it'd be so funny. Million with my millions. Forgot I can lay this one down too. Can I please get a heads? So good. Such a good card, man. Underrated. You know, it, it took him a while to put that card there. He was like, are you serious? Now he doesn't have enough energy on Pinsir. He's out. He's gone. He's done. He's out. He's finished. Finito. One heads. One heads flip. One heads. Sea King may look dumb, but goddamn. Good shit. Just not, just not far enough. Not far enough. Hey, we go first this time. Well, second this time. It was basically first. Getting energy first. I wish I could play my Pokeballs on this point. Oh, it's a Mewtwo deck. It doesn't matter if I go first. He has butt plug fingers. I don't like him. Oh. The the Professor Oak uh, voice lines from Pokemon Snap live live with me to this day. They are, they are embedded into my cranium, my, my brainium, my vibranium cranium. Oh, <laughs> what's that? Oh, that's fun. Never chase no bitch. Mask off, eating applesauce. Mask off, eating applesauce. Mask out. You got a mother six. Bring out the snake. If you got the moolah, I do the moving. Otherwise, the snake stays in the cage. In and off of coop. Overdue. Badly move. Bust a move. James. 33. Air. Yeah. I don't know. His hype man is so funny to me. Big phones. It might just be him. I don't even know if it is just Future just saying to hype himself up. I don't know, but it's still funny. I think it is just him. <laughs> Never chase a bitch. Mask off. Fucking mask off. Seeking Blastoise. Fresh love. Can we get a hit? Nope. Let me look at Nope. <laughs> the adult prescriptions. Yeah. Is he going to hit me with that? Uh, whatever it is. Oh, he just got a Ralts. He's got a fucking Ralts. His name is, uh, Bush. 
I don't know Japanese. Why would you do that? Why would you use that? There is no reason to use Giovanni. I think people be using Giovanni for no reason. Sometimes people just be being dumb, man. Like real talk. They just be mad dumb. Great. Bitch. Can I talk to you for a minute? We want to add pressure to this dude so he has to get out. Strategy is way off with the early Geo. It, it, it just made no sense. Cause he, he has to deal a hundred damage and a hundred is 50 plus 50. He does not need to deal 110. So he, he's overkilling with the early Geo. That makes no sense. And the potion makes sense, but my Geo would make sense right now. My Geo would make perfect sense. This is when you use Geo. This is how you use Giovanni. You know, when you need that extra, mm, you know, that, mm, that's when you use Giovanni, you know? It makes sense if he thinks I have a potion. No, it doesn't. You wanna know why it doesn't if he thinks I have a potion? Because even if I had a potion, he would still, he would, he, he's, he, why would he, why would he do that? Even if I had a potion, he could just wait and use Giovanni next turn. Cause I didn't have a potion. Most of all, you won't help him find a funk. If I get my war turtle next turn, I can do something. If I don't, nothing can be done here. He doesn't know that, but there's no reason to look at it and know. You know, like there's no reason to like do it without. He, you have to play Giovanni retroactively in some, in most cases. In that case, he could have just killed me with another 50 points of size sphere. It doesn't matter if he knows it or not, because it, it, it didn't matter. Let's say I did have a potion. If I did have a potion, he would still be fine. Cause then he would just use Giovanni. Cause it's, I, I would have, I'd have 70 HP, but like, like who cares? Does Giovanni like pineapple on pizza? Probably not. So he kills Squirtle or he does Sabrina and kills Goldine. But then next turn I can like swap out with either one of these and get out. Yo, Night Ranger, welcome to the Loop Troop. Thanks for the follow. What's up, we got ads to this. Hi, does anyone know if the event stamina will save for the next event? I doubt it. I doubt it. I think they're gonna start you over with new stamina. And those hourglasses that they gave you, they were only for what you call it. For like one thing, I have three Blastoises in my deck right now that can kill him. And I got one, I got one of the ones. <laughs> so we had a high chance of pulling a Blastoise right there. He'll know if we got it too, so. Thank y'all finally now. Oh no, he's going to kill my Squirtle boy. Oh. No son. <laughs> no son. <laughs> Here it comes. Here it comes. I heard you were fucking with my goddamn son.
damn it. I was trying to get rid of the stuff that would tell me stuff so I could kill him. All sorts. Buddy said, what happened to the shades? Like, I'm ugly. <laughs> Like, what happened to the shades? Oh my god, it's tedious. That's all I got. You like my Spider Man shirt? Thank you. My girlfriend got it for me. Speak of the devil. Hope no red card, yeah. If they have one, it's whatever, I guess. Yep, no red card yet, guys. So go ahead and go on the swar turtle. Put down a goling. There's no way he'll get a double. Well, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna back up. Standard pincer deck. Pincer are barely even nowhere. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. Eggs. I mean, I can one shot everything if if given the opportunity to. gotten a golding and a sea king in a long time those are my most successful deck build so far oh shit thing crashed. Oh my god. Just, just, just enough time. I did everything I needed, but damn. I was in a poison shot Koga deck. Yeah, that was probably the best one so far. Probably electric sludge. You just wasted all your good luck on that 10, 10 energy thing. You're gonna feel so dumb. Guys, it's not fair. 
Thank God. He honestly should have swapped over to Executor already, but he's greedy. I don't like him having that pincer out there either. Where's my Sea Kings at? So he did 50 damage. So if he did 50 damage to this, it'd be at 50. So he could kill me next turn still. Why don't I just look and see how much it would be? Okay. So yeah. It'd be better just to do this. Yo, double line. Welcome to the loop troop. Thanks for the follow. My pockets are full of stuff. Oh shit, you stream double? double? Oh shit, get this, give this man a shout out. Oh, wow. You dabble? Looks to be more than a dabble to me. Guys, go check out Double Lime. Please do. If you don't, then Madge. You got taken out by a, a derpy ass uh, fish. <laughs> hey, w, it, Double, it's always a, a hobby. It's always a hobby. So he's put himself in a weird predicament right now, unless he puts something else down here. So he can't attack me next turn, but I can Sabrina him in. Oh, never mind. He's gonna put in Venusaur. I'm fine with it. I would love to hit Venusaur first. Did he use Razor Leaf or Giant Bloom? Okay, he did have another Pokemon. Okay. Why didn't he kill that?
It doesn't matter if he has Sabrina or not, though. It's the same predicament. He Sabrina's, he brings in my Sea King. It was already out. He has to back up now. No, I had Sabrina, but there was no reason for me to like Sabrina him out. It's better to hit Venusaur first. Yep, so now he puts this in here. He can't retreat back out now. He's dead. I deal 160 damage. Oh, you're telling me that I should have Sabrina him. Well, I don't want to do that because if I Sabrina him, he always puts in one of these. I didn't know what you were talking about. <laughs> I was like, what are you talking about? I was, I was so confused. I'm like, what do you mean? Well, yeah, no, it doesn't matter if he has Sabrina or not. I mean, it, it doesn't matter if I Sabrina him or not. Cause he always puts the back line in, lets me kill it and then comes in. It, it's This game is a game about hitting first. You know, like I'm always doing 160 damage. So I always kill Executor. And now it, it's like, if I hit, well, it's a game about when you hit and how you hit. You know, because if I would have, let's say that I did, if he, he had two, one, one cost or one prize Mons up there, he never puts in Venusaur or he never puts in Executor because he would just be killing himself, right? So there's no way he would ever do that. Oh, now I'm just flossing. To 11. We're gonna get caught with a 187. Then no big blank. Oh, Kiki, when did you say there were ads? Oh, go, go ahead and run them, Kiki. I'll stall. And every time we take it, I'll be throwing in my six foe. What all the body saying? Ding down, I wanna ride. Swing down, sweet cherry, I wanna ride. Yo, Jin Ryan 975, welcome to the Loop Troop, homie. Thanks for the follow. You did mention you get ADHD with ads. I do, but I didn't see it. I didn't see it at all. Sometimes they're just too, listen, at some point, it's gonna be really hard to, to, to do um, no ads over gameplay, but I try my best to. I try my best to. See, baby, see, baby. What you doing? What you doing? What you doing? <laughs> and a robe, I look too good to be alone. No red cards. Please don't do it. I ain't playing no games everywhere that I say is coming straight from the heart. So if you're trying to lay in these arms. I'm gonna leave it open, y'all. Can we get a heads in this bitch? Fuck yeah, baby, let's go. All we gotta do is kill Pikachu and we'll be fine. We kill Pikachu and we're good. We're good. We're good and we're gravy, everybody. Modified it, surge deck. Yeah. He has to have another Pokemon down here to be able to kill Sea King this turn. Can he do it? Probably. I got two star Marowak from 10 booster. 
Damn it. Okay, he won't be able to kill us though with our Blastoise, so. And he already used Professor, so he'll kill Sea King this turn. Oh man, he's gonna kill me though. He's gonna kill me. I need to get Misty and get another hit. Getting Misty is the only way I can win right now. Well, actually, no, it's not. If I had two more energy, he'd be dead right now. He still has to hit us for quite a bit. Like he can hit me right now, but he would die. He, he can back up with X speed and then go into Raichu, but I'll kill Raichu next turn, but he'll kill me the turn after. Like he's gonna go into Lieutenant Surge. Like I'm pretty sure he has Lieutenant Surge, right? If he doesn't have Lieutenant Surge, then I can kill him, but he probably has it. Yes, 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 yes. He didn't have it. He didn't, he didn't have it. He didn't have it, guys. Shh, Omega Lucky. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to drop a comment down in the chat. Let me know. Also, I have some videos over here on the side. If you want to check those out, we have other deck videos. We have tons of off-meta things here on the channel. Please check them out, and I'll catch you guys in the flip. Peace.